Tomo News presents Big Dogs. Heroic dog saves owner's life. 2017 started out horribly for one Michigan man who spent New Year's Day injured and helpless in the snow. Luckily, it was man's best friend to the rescue. At 10.30 p.m. on December 31st, Bob ran out to get another log for his fire when he slipped and fell on the ice, breaking his neck. Unable to move, he screamed for help, but with the nearest neighbor a quarter mile away, it was his golden retriever, Kelsey, that ran to his side. The temperature dipped to freezing, but Kelsey stayed by Bob, barking for help and licking his face and hands to keep him warm. The 64-year-old lost consciousness, but Kelsey's howling eventually got the attention of a neighbor who finally discovered Bob 20 hours later. He was rushed to the hospital where a doctor performed emergency surgery to save him. Now recovering nicely, Bob claims he owes his life to two heroes, his dog and his doctor. Who's a clever boy then? This dog proved he's smarter than your average pooch when he broke out of his kennel earlier this week and wandered off into the night. The 10-year-old Great Pyrenees named General was lodging at an animal hospital in Stafford, Virginia, while his owners went to Virginia Beach on vacation. And as you can see from the footage, perhaps he wanted out so he could go join them. At around 4.15 a.m. on Monday, General busted out of his temporary accommodation, then opened at least four different doors in his heroic bid for freedom. He'd been staying at the animal hospital for the previous two nights, but clearly had had enough. Here we see the 124-pound dog making his way down a hallway, then sniffing around an office area. If General looks familiar with the surroundings, his owner said that's because the clever canine had been visiting the hospital for the past 10 months. Finally, General uses his mouth to open a door that leads him outside to a parking lot. Then off he went into the night. Around three hours later, hospital staff discovered General was missing and called his owners. The search for the dog went on for most of Monday. He was eventually found at 9 p.m., around 17 hours after he went missing in action. General was sitting in the garden of a nearby home, happy to be in the great outdoors and out of his cage. The dog's owners cut short their vacation to search for the beloved pet, and they were eventually reunited. So who's a clever boy then? Massively adorable UK dog weighs over 200 pounds. Meet Yogi, or Bear, as he's appropriately known, in his hometown of Gainsborough, Lincolnshire. Funny story, his owner, Sue Markham, actually told her husband, who didn't want a big dog, that he was a Jack Russell when she bought him. But when he didn't stop growing, the jig was up. When I bought him home, I told my husband that he was a Jack Russell. <laughs> a Jack Russell puppy. And then, of course, he started growing and growing, and the joke was gone then. Yeah, he's grown exceptionally big. We didn't imagine it would be this big. As a puppy, he weighed a little over one pound. But now this Boston Great Dane weighs an astonishing 210 pounds and stands at 36 inches tall when on all fours. How on earth do you manage to walk this guy? The nine-year-old's weekly food intake costs around 60 US dollars and in addition to dog food includes minced beef, eggs, sausages, rice, yogurts, bananas, and even ginger biscuits. Now that's one hell of a food intake for one extra large pooch. Maybe you should try some doggy Zumba to shed some of those pounds. Former Playboy Playmate takes her obese dog on first class flight. Hank the dog is treated like a king by his owner, Carrie Whitman, an interior designer and Playboy Playmate of the Month from February 1988. According to Hank's Instagram account, Carrie, who founded the Beverly Hills Dog Rescue Program called Ace of Hearts, rescued the obese dog from an animal shelter in Los Angeles. Carrie and Hank were spotted at the Los Angeles International Airport, with Carrie pulling Hank in his cart. Hank is obese and has an illness that means he can only move with the aid of the cart, but he still gets the royal treatment and lots of attention from strangers. When traveling with Carrie, he travels first class all the way, including his own seat on board the plane. Nicknamed Hank the Tank for his large size, he is Carrie's support dog and can detect seizures. The picture of him boarding the American Airlines flight at LAX has gone viral, so keep an eye out for this big old dog on your next trip. Madeline Doe, who snapped the picture of Hank and Carrie, followed up by tweeting, I'm just glad my legacy on this site will be a photo I took of an obese dog boarding a plane. Dog missing nearly two years found safe near Lake Tahoe. 
A couple whose golden retriever ran off scared after hearing a gunshot in Tahoe National Forest in November 2012 has been found safe. Murphy, the five-year-old golden retriever, was on a camping trip with her owners, Nathan and Aaron Braun, when the gunshot scared her off. The Brauns tried chasing her, but the dog could not be found. In the hope of finding Murphy, the Braun set up a Facebook page with photos of Murphy and asked people to post dog sightings. This past month, at a French Meadows Reservoir campsite, about five miles from where Murphy was lost, a dog of her description was seen. So, the Braun drove out to the site to leave Murphy's blanket and Nathan's ball cap, and the dog began sleeping on these items. Eventually, the dog was lured into a kennel, and the Bronze drove out to retrieve the dog. The dog is much skinnier and looks a bit different than the Murphy the Bronze lost, but they say they are 99% sure their Murphy is now safe at home. Family raises money for a dog with backwards legs. Rexy the Golden Retriever started off her young life just like every other puppy, running around and playing. But at about 10 weeks of age, the California couple who owns her noticed her walking with a strange limp. Over time, that limp developed into a mysterious condition that had Rexy's legs winding backwards, leaving her front legs without any functionality and her walking around on two. Doctors have not been able to diagnose the dog other than to call it a neurological problem. Rather than have her put down, her family has set up a GoFundMe page to raise $20,000 for a solution. Until then, she seems content to get around with what she's got, which isn't much. Maybe we could all learn a little about overcoming adversity from Rexy. Dog marooned in icy river, saved by firefighters. This is Cooper, a golden retriever poodle cross, and he's in a bit of trouble. Here he is, stuck on a tree in Boston's frigid Charles River. And he was done for until firefighters right waited out to rescue him. <laughs> His owners say he'd bolted during a Saturday walk along the riverbank. They posted up flyers around the neighborhood and luckily got the call on Sunday. Someone had spotted Cooper in his icy death trap. So Wellesley firefighters geared up and went to work. I got him. Chris, pull that back. It's okay, him. buddy. Maybe it's all right. all the way out. Yeah. It's all right. Right up, pull you on Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Good thing it wasn't Group B's engine. Cooper. 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 The unlucky mutt was reunited with his family and is probably going to be grounded until summer. A seven-pound Yorkie named Cory almost became bird food. Cory ran into the woods behind his house. Among the trees, Cory didn't notice the hawk, which swooped down and dug its talons into the little dog. Lucky for Cory, Dakota, the yellow lab, heard his cries and came running. Dakota arrived just in time to drive away the hawk, saving Cory's life and ensuring they'll both live to play another day. Corey required stitches for his wounds, but is expected to fully recover.